Hey everybody, welcome to the Daily App Show. Today we have an application for the Mac for you called Zoom It. Now this is a very powerful magnification tool that we can use on the fly or use it permanently, whatever we want to do, and it's really fully customizable as well. So whether you're an engineer or an artist or a developer or anybody like that that needs to see something very precisely, this is going to be great for you to use. So you can see here we have our keyboard shortcuts all laid out for us. We can actually change these at any time and we'll update here as well. So it's not going to be just like this static image that we have to remember what we have to do uh, for our keyboard shortcuts. Anytime that we change them, they're going to update here as well. So you can see we have here, we can turn on our magnifier uh, permanently by tapping the uh, Alt Z button. And you can see it's already here. Now I just pressed it and I let it go. And now we're using it here. We can use, we can drag, anything that we need to do. We can still use our mouse with this magnification. So that's cool as well. We can actually increase and decrease the size of this by tapping uh, control and the open or close brackets button. So I'm holding control and I'm tapping those buttons uh, either way here, any way that I want to do it. And I can even increase and decrease the zoom level by do using the control button and e either the equals or the minus button. So that's going to be great as well. Uh, so I'm moving that all around. Now I can get rid of this once again uh, by tapping that uh, Alt Z button and now that's gone. So if I want to pull it up uh, spontaneously though, or I need to use it just real quick and I don't need it permanently on, I can actually use the Control Z button and now I'm holding those and I can move this around, let it go at any time. You can see here it's real easy, real quick to do. But say I needed to use uh, my mouse while I'm doing this and I can't hold the Control button, I can let go of the Control button and just hold the Z button. Now I'm holding the Z button and I'm just moving this around and I can still use my mouse because I'm only holding the Z button. So that's going to be great for us to do. So this is the welcome screen. Like I said before, I can close this at any point and use my computer however I'd want to use it. I don't have to have that open uh, to use this or anything like that, so that's going to be great as well. I can come up here to the magnifying glass, and you can see I have a few different options. I can show or hide the LALP. Um, I can use the LALP zoom here, uh, adjust the size, adjust the shape. We can even do a rectangular one here, so you can see now that's a rectangular one. Uh, or I can turn that off if I wanted to as well. Now I can also go into the welcome screen, which is what we just had, or go into our settings, and here's where we can change our keyboard shortcuts, or we can restore them if we don't like those ones, if we feel like these ones are adequate as well, and we can change these options too. So this is going to be a really powerful tool, like I said, if you're a developer or anybody like that that really needs to get in there and see uh, stuff real close and real uh, magnified, maybe individual pixels or anything unbelievably close or something like that, this would be a great application for you to use. So once again, this application is available for the Mac. It is called Zoom It. If you like it, be sure to pick it up in the App Store today.